Brian Johnny here and welcome to Birdland. Thank you for tuning in. Now in our 18th week of live streaming, please welcome the Afro-Latin Jazz Orchestra directed by the maestro Arturo O'Farrell.
welcome to week 18 of our virtual Birdland series. We're having a best of retrospective show today and that what you heard is one of the best ofs. That was the composition Samba for Carmen by Paquito de Rivera, arranged masterfully by Chico O'Farrell and featuring Paquito de Rivera on the alto saxophone. And our guest guitarist Richard Miller and our guest percussionist Everton Isidoro. We're gonna play a piece for you now that is beautiful. Um, it's written by Violeta Parra, arranged by Jason Lindner and features Carolina Mama. This piece is called Volver a los 17.
Volver a los 17, featuring a beautiful performance by Carolina Mama. It also featured Brian Davis, Adam O'Farrell, Rachel Therian, and Seneca Black on the trumpets. On the trombone, it featured Abdul Rahman Amer, and on the congas, Kesel Jimenez. This next piece means a lot to me, it was on the Pure Emotion recording, which was the first of a trio of records that Chico Farrell did for fantasy. Um, and it featured one of my heroes, one of the greatest musicians I've ever known, a gentleman who I adored and adore still. His name is Mario Rivera. And in this performance, you'll see his protege, a young musician who I also adore and admire and love so very much. This is Ivan Renta playing uh, the music of his mentor. This is En La Oscuridad.
En la Oscuridad by Rafael Solano, arranged by Chico Farrell and featuring Ivan Renta on the tenor saxophone. We have a very important message coming to you from Rudrash Mahanta, but please pay close attention. Hi, this is alto saxophonist Rudrash Mahanta, and I got a question for you. What is more important than the groove? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. There, I said it. I said it, Rudresh Mahantapa said it, Kesel Jimenez said it, Joanna Obieta has said it. What is more important than the groove? Nothing. And we need to keep that groove going. We need to keep musicians going. It's hard enough in a pandemic and in a time of racial division and political indifference from Washington, but to also not be able to pay your bills is really hard, really difficult, and I'm telling you, that there are musicians and freelance artists out there who need your help. Would you do me a favor? Would you take a second and think about the times you've enjoyed freelance art in New York City and what it has meant to you and your family? And then would you take another second and see how you can be part of Nuestro Mundo, our world. See how you can take up the call and respond with generosity at this very moment. Contribute to the Afro-Latin Jazz Alliance Emergency Artists Fund. There are folks right there who can't pay their rent, who can't put food on their tables, and they've spent hours and days and years of their lives dedicated to serving you with the mastery of their craft. Think about it for a second. And if you're out there and you're an artist and you're suffering and you're hungry and you really need of some help, please apply to the Afro-Latin Jazz Alliance Emergency Artist Fund. We'd love to be a part of your lives. This next piece is gonna feature uh, Laura Andrea Leguia and a beautiful composition that she wrote called Junio Igarua, and then she also features some very special Afro-Peruvian friends. So we hope you enjoy Junio and Garua.
The amazing saxophonist, composer, arranger, Laura Andrea Leguia, playing her composition, Junio and Garua, also featuring Yuri Juarez, master guitarist, Freddy Huevito Lobaton on the cajon. She also featured Jason Marshall on baritone saxophone and Greg August on the bass. It's a wonderful piece. We hope you enjoyed it from the archives. We're going to continue by playing a performance of a composition and arrangement by a great friend, a visionary drummer and composer whose name is Daphne Spieto. And he wrote this piece to celebrate the contribution that my father Chico O'Farrell made to the music. He calls this piece a song for Chico.
Roman Filiu on the alto saxophone, performing Daphne's Prietos, a song for Chico, that also featured Vince Cherico on the drums. We have a very special opportunity this week to spend some time with Vince, Vinny, we call him in the band, with Vinny, giving us a master class. On August 19th, you have an opportunity to learn about percussion, Afro-Latin, Afro-Cuban, Afro-Mexican, Afro-Yoga, Zen, Buddhist, Baptist rhythms from the master. He knows so much, man. Don't miss this opportunity to spend time with Vince Cherico at his master class. On August 30th, we'll also be doing a very special virtual Birdland with guests from all over the world. They'll be performing with us in Kuwait, in Abu Dhabi, in London, in Paris. This is part of our Cuba Meets Kaliji project, and we hope that you don't miss this very special virtual Birdland on August 30th. There are many people that I want to thank. I want to begin by thanking Johnny Valente in Birdland. This September would have been our 25th anniversary of uh, Sundays at Birdland. Um, and we're still here. You're still there, and we're still celebrating. But we want to take a minute and thank Johnny Valenti for this beautiful, beautiful 25 years. We want to take a minute and thank the Afro-Latin Jazz Alliance. Without their help, we wouldn't be able to do this. Marietta Ulasia, our executive director. Andrea Thompson, our director of development. Eric Toller, our director of production. We want to thank Zach O'Farrell, our director of education. Stefan Ande Mikael, our director of operations. We want to thank Felipe Tristan, our manager of marketing and communications, and Gina Soto, our music administration manager. There's so many people we want to thank. We want to thank the Afro Latin Jazz Orchestra, the mighty, powerful, superhero Afro Latin Jazz Orchestra, our saxophone section, Alejandro Aviles, Addison Evans, Roman Filiu, Jasper Dutz. Jeremy Powell, Ivan Renta, and Larry Bustamante. We want to thank the mighty, powerful Afro Latin Jazz trumpet section Brian Davis, Walter Cano, Seneca Black, Rachel Farian, and Adam O'Farrell. We want to thank the Afro Latin Jazz Orchestra trombone section Mario Bilston, Rafi Malkiel, Abdul Rahman, Amer Zito Lavelle, Earl McIntyre, and James Rogers ever the center of the storm. Vince Cherico on the drums. Bam, 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 bam. Rodriguez on the bass. Quesel Jimenez on the congas. Carly Carlos Maldonado on the bongo and the bell. Myself on piano. It is our privilege to be here every week. And by the way, I just want to mention this. Every week I look in the chat section and there are people joining us from Indonesia and South America and Europe and throughout the world. And I just want to say that that's the thing. There's an equation. There's us and there's you. And as long as there's us and as long as there's you, there's an equation going on. It makes everything worth it. All the hardship that we're going through is worth it because at the end of the day, we're here and you're there. And we are joining in, in an experiment that is as old as time. Playing music you love with people you love for people you love. Thank you for the privilege of being here. We're going to close now with a composition that I wrote um, about fluidity, about uh, genre fluidity, uh, about food fluidity, about fluid fluidity. Um, it's dedicated to my late great uncle Stan Furman, who was one of the true great state senators of the great state of Arizona. Um, he championed uh, Martin Luther King Day. He's a civil rights hero is what he was, my uncle Stan Furman. We love you. We miss you. Um, this piece is called Gulab Hamon. Thank you all for being here. Love you guys. Take care.
you've enjoyed this evening's performance. We want to thank you for joining us. And just a reminder, Birdland has been doing live streaming every week. So for further information, you can always check us out at birdlandjazz.com. Once again, thank you for tuning in and see you next week.